we've been studying how organizations such as the SPCA help our community. Since we have been learning about persuasive writing, I printed off some of the persuasive paragraphs the SPCA writes to convince people to adopt the animals there. Now, who remembers what two things are in a good persuasive paragraph? Peter? Fact and opinion. Yes, fact and opinion. So let's look at this paragraph about Hagger the cat. Tell me a fact. I was found and brought to the SPCA of Texas in McKinney on June 8th. I am a six-year-old male domestic short hair mix. Can any of you tell me an opinion? My prayer is, is music to your ears. Excellent. Great job. What else? I love everyone I meet. Excellent job, boys and girls. I can't wait for you to try this on your own. Now here is something I know you are all going to be excited about. After you do your fact and opinion, you and your partner are going to use the coins that you brought in to donate to the SPCA and make a portrait of your animal. We will then count up all of our coins to find out how much our picture is worth. Can you tell me a fact? Two-year-old female shepherd mix. Very good. Let's highlight that in green. Can you tell me an opinion? Very good. Let's go ahead and highlight that in yellow. Remember, we only need just one dot of glue so it will stay still lying down so then we can take it right back off to give to the SPCA. Oh, that looks just like your dog. Boys and girls, you did such a great job yesterday with our fact and opinion. I can't wait for us to share with each other. Now, who would like to go first? Okay, let's have Lucas and Allie come up first. You know, why don't you just go ahead and hold it up so everyone can see it. This is our cat. Can anyone tell me a fact? Hmm. You know, why don't we just pass it around? Beautiful picture of your cat that you made. Allie, you want to show it to the class? Hi! Her head! <laughs> you know, let's just count the coins and see how much she's worth. 72 cents? Excellent job. Now who wants to go next? projects didn't go so well, but today we'll be fine. I copied your paragraphs on transparencies 
and we can use this overhead money for our pictures. Now, who wants to go first? picture. What matters is about the persuasive paragraph. Now, who can tell me a fact? I am a two-year-old lobster? That isn't what it says. <laughs> can anyone tell me how well they did on their paragraph? It looks to me like I would love to be a loyal, I mean, a loyal friend is the gray that is the green highlighter when it should be the gray that is the yellow highlighter because it's an opinion. What an excellent observation. It is the yellow highlighter. We know it's an opinion. Sure, it looks green to me. Are you sure that's your dog? It kind of looks like our cat. Oh, let's just go get our coin pictures. Don't hold it up. There aren't enough quarters. Just use a nickel. There aren't enough nickels. Here. Just do the best you can. Here, I'll just pretend this quarter is, I mean, this, this dime is a nickel, and I'll draw some pennies with this pen. That's the spirit. We just need to count it.
sure that was in the hall? That's odd that Mrs. Rose's class wouldn't be using it on their day. I think they had something else going on. I think it was something about water. Well, you don't have to ask me twice. Let's present those awesome SPCA projects. Let's go! Why that projector isn't in my classroom when it's my day?